Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. I'm Jessica, the Dancing Avon Lady, and today we are doing a smell-a-thon. That's right. We are smelling brand new candles that have just been launched from Avon Canada. I'm so excited for this one because I love candles. I think they just give this beautiful warmth and glow and ambience to your home. And we all know we're spending a lot more time at home right now, aren't we? By getting some candles into your room in different areas of your house even, you can create this gorgeous, really unique, personalized to you scent story essentially and so that's what i love about candles i don't even necessarily burn them all the time but i do have candles in different areas of my house so that i can experience them if i want to the i have four candles in total for you to experience today three of them are from the layers redefined collection and one of them is from our aloe fruits and passions collection first what i'm going to show you guys here are the layers redefined one that's what the l y r d does stand for and i do have three for you the first one here is the juicy current and magnolia the second one is the rose blossom and musk and then the final one here is the layers redefined violet and birch candle all of these candles they are 312 grams the container itself is made from glass and um, they are all three wick candles the candles they give approximately 30 hour burn time and what you want to do at the very beginning is you want to light all three of the wicks let it burn from an hour for about an hour blow it out let it solidify again and then you can burn as your uh, as you would normally do but that will help to prolong the life of these candles each one is 11 centimeters in diameter and eight centimeters high and these are soy blend wax okay so these are created with soy blend wax which is great because it provides a cleaner burn now for the longest time i had no idea what cleaner burn really meant and so i had to do some research according to pureintegrity.com soy wax candles they generally do burn longer than paraffin uh, candles soy wax is derived from natural vegetables while paraffin wax is refined uh, is a is a refined gasoline byproduct soy wax is also 100 percent biodegradable while paraffin is not so soy wax uh, candles are better for the environment soy wax also releases fragrance easier than paraffin candles so you're gonna have a better um a better scent experience from homesick.com they said soy wax candles does have a stronger fragrance, as I just mentioned, but also soy wax candles, they also release less soot and toxins into the air than paraffin wax candles. And uh, the thing is with paraffin wax candles, the chemicals, the chemicals, they can also interfere with the scent during burning, which kind of also defeats the purpose of lighting a candle, right? Because we want to experience the scent in its whole, in its entirety. These make a fantastic gift either for yourself or for a loved one. They are just absolutely beautiful. And so I'm going to open one up. For those who don't know, this is my daughter, Ginevra. Can you go on tippy toes? Hi. How old are you? Can you use your words? How old are you? Six. Six, Six years old. She's getting tired. It's the end of the day. All right. So this, ooh. <gasps> wow. What do you think? Is that pretty? So this one here is the Rose Blossom and Musk. So they do not come with a, a lid. Why? I don't know. But it comes with this little papery thing. And here it is. This beautiful creamy texture. It's like an off-white. Ooh. Mmm. It does. But Mommy finds actually the musky smell comes in. It's really, really pretty. So it is a very feminine, very sensual scent. And the, the depth from the musk, oh my gosh. You want to smell it, Moy? You got to tell me, Mama, what it smells like, okay? What does it smell like? Mm, it smells like one of the soaps. It smells like a soap. Okay. Do you like it? Yeah. Oh, it smells like a soap. Here, I'll move this over for you a little bit so we can see you better. There we go. There we go. What kind of soap does it smell like? One of the baths, no? Oh, this would be beautiful with a in a bubble bath. Oh, you know it smells. It smells a little bit like your bubble bath. Yeah, it smells a little bit like if you're familiar with the Avon bubble bath, guys. It smells a little bit like the soft pink one, but a little bit more musk to it. Oh, it's very pretty. Very, very uh, pretty. Mama, yes, love. It smells like my soap, soap that I use for bath. Oh, does it smell like your soap that you use for bath? Very cool. So let's move on to the second one. Which one should we open up next? The pink one, of course. It's, it's Ginevra. She loves pink. 
Yay! So the pink one here, this is the Juicy Currant and Magnolia. Magnolias are one of my favorite flowers. That and Gerber daisies and peonies. <laughs> I never heard of those. Our neighbors have it. They have a big tree in the spring and it has these magnolia flowers. They're so pretty. But the sound of a juicy currant, it sounds like it's going to smell like nice and fresh too, which is nice. Oh, it's so pretty. Look at, look at, look at, look at, look at this. Yeah. So this itself looks really beautiful when you, it, it, when you just open it and you experience this, it's a stunning visual to see. Also like the packaging itself, it has this like beautiful creamy milk glass that you can always repurpose later on. You can use it to put your jewelry in, you can use it, um, to put maybe some of your makeup products in but it is a really beautiful container it has like this matte-ish label that's really nice as well so this one is juicy current egg magnolia are you ready to smell it <sighs> do you like it it smells like coconut it's, no it has no coconut scent too i don't smell any coconut you smell coconut you smell coconut? Let me see. What are the what are the scent notes of this one? So the Leia's Redefined Candles, just so you guys know, they are crafted by expert perfumers. So it's basically people who bake also our fragrances. They have a have a hand in creating the scent, the scent composition for these candles. And so this one, the it's a mix of juicy current sweet rhubarb. That's what I'm smelling. And then also the blooming magnolia. It's more fruity, this one. I really like it. It's very bright and happy smelling. And it's, it smells like, almost like a pie. Or like jam. Doesn't it smell like jam? Does it smell like jam? It smells like um, strawberry jam mixed up with raspberry jam. Mm -hmm. Yeah, very bright and fresh. And sweet. Yes, excellent. So it's very bright, fresh, sweet, smells kind of like, berries and that'll probably be the current and some even some of the rhubarb scent coming in oh this one's beautiful i really like this one. this one is making my tummy growl it's making mommy <laughs> want some juice yeah. i want some juice you want some juice maybe we'll get some juice after this video homo yeah, yeah, yeah. The, the, the juice. hey mama hmm? it's like the twins <laughs> yeah yeah. The scent notes of the rose blossom and musk candle. So it has pink peony, rose blossom, and soft musk. Compared to the juicy kern and magnolia, this one has a much more delicate scent to it. The other one does seem to have a bit of a stronger smell. All right. Last of the layers redefined candles is this one here, which is violet birch. I picked it because it's purple. <laughs> I love purple. Should I have picked the other one because it's pink, right, Moi? Yeah, so here we are. Oh, I love the covers. The covers are so gorgeous. All right, so here it is. Oh, wow. This, it has delicate violet crisp birch and warm vanilla. Yeah, it has like a very soulful scent to this yeah, one. I can smell it from here. Yeah? What, do, what does it smell like? I don't know. You don't know? Okay. It smells like a sweet vanilla. Yes, it has a little bit, you can smell that little bit of vanilla at the very bottom base of it. Also a little sweet. Yeah, it's a little bit, I don't, it smells very floral. This one smells very perfumey to me. Okay, so it, 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 yeah, it smells very perfumey to me. So I can, I can see someone wearing this as a fragrance, if you will. And it, I find this one to be probably the strongest of the three. This one again, guys, is the uh, violet and birch. Now, funnily, funnily, I always say funnily, I don't even think it's a real word, but funnily enough, I thought that this one would be my favorite because of the violet in it, but I actually, the magnolia and the uh, current, that one's my favorite out of the three. I think it's just because it is a lot stronger. And so it kind of tickles my nose just a little bit. Like they're all really, really beautiful, but I do find that, my nose is gravitating towards the red, the current one the most. So now we have one final candle that is not part of the Layers Redefined line, but it is the candle that is in the Aloe Fruits and Passion line. Do you think we can smell it if without, without, the, without opening the candle? Possibly. All right, are we ready for this? All right, ooh, ooh, oh, I love it. It is so cute. <gasps> okay, this is the orange cantaloupe. Now, 
I didn't think that I would like it, but I smelled it in a form of, I think it was like a hand cream or something, and I loved it. So that's why I chose this scent. I am obsessed with this one in Pear and Peony from the Aloe line. I am obsessed with it, and I just started using the Grapefruit Guava Shower Gel. It's just, I find that uh, from a budgetary standpoint, it is really well priced, but also the, the, the scents aren't overpowering, and it is really nice. It, it's just like the perfect balance for me. So that's why I really, really, really love it. I can smell it from out here. Yeah. Can you? What does it smell like? Uh, it smells like the fruit. Oh. Kind of. Yeah. So here it is. Isn't this one redonkulously cute? It is the aloe orange cantaloupe perfumed candle. I always love it when they have the word bougie in front of it. I, I don't know. Bougie just, it's, it's a funny word, it, but I, I'm 90% sure that it means candle in French. B bougie parfumé. And so these candles are created in Canada, which is, again, is another added bonus. The glass is kind of decorative and it is recyclable and reusable definite bonus to that they these ones are handmade um, it is also plant-based wax it's not tested on animals and there's no animal derived ingredients I love that the top here is made out of wood which is nice um, and they do suggest that you trim the wick one quarter inch before every use and you don't want to let wick residue or other waste accumulate in the liquefied wax so if the top of the wick it does kind of burn and drop into the into the wax you want to get rid of it you want to scoop it up and throw it away you don't want to let it sit in there the approximate burn time for this is actually 35 hours so even though it looks tinier it has a longer burn time which is really cool what Avon suggests is that you want to let the candle burn for at least two hours in the first session and then after that let it burn for a maximum of four hours in every following session just so that you can prolong the life of it and get the max usage out of this candle also another thing to note is that the container itself will get hot when you burn it obviously because there's a fire inside so just be aware guys be careful and you also want to place it on a temperature safe surface and keep away from from drafts pets and kids when you put the fire on the candle yeah do you like have to blow them out and then put them back on again and again if you yep. want yeah again and again if you want but only adults never kids and i have uh, and my second is that i wish that was was wood if if baby brother would grab it oh i know he probably would baby brother grabs everything Are you ready to open the lid and to smell it, but let's open the, this beauty. Oh. So there is a wick here. You want to trim that to a quarter inch before use. And I'm surprised. Oh. Mm. Oh. This one smells so yummy. Mm. It does. It smells really yummy, guys. This one smells delicious. <laughs> My tummy is grumbling. Mm. This one's beautiful. Mmm. Yep. I'm surprised it only has one candle. Yeah, one wick? Yeah, because this is a single wick candle. So there's three wick candles and there's single wick candles and this one just happens to be a single wick candle. Yeah, I think it's because it's smaller. So for this one, you definitely get that orange scent, that really vibrant citrusy scent to it. But it has like the sweetness from the cantaloupe and I'm normally not a melon person, but for some reason this, for the aloe line, I love the cantaloupe and orange. Wow, it smells really, really delicious. And it, it's like nice, bright, cheery, fantastic for uh, when cleaning days if you want things to smell really nice and fresh. I want, I'm glad to see if they have the pear and peony one. And if they do, I'm going to have to get that too because these are really well priced. So these are $18.50 uh, for one. And then the layers redefined one, they are regular $35. Uh, and currently, as of today, the day of filming, they are on promotion for $28. For value-wise, I'd probably go for this, although I still really love the scent of this one. Which one do you like the best? Or? Which one do you like more? You like this one more? Because it smells like oranges and you love oranges? I like oranges. This one does smell a little bit like... barrier, <laughs> like just brighter. Mm, 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 mm. Yeah. I like this one because it doesn't almost make me sneeze. Mm, yes, this one is definitely a lot lighter. It's not that it's dull, you can't smell it, you can smell it, but it's just, it has a more delicate combination of scents, I think. I don't know, but I really like this one. I would definitely, I definitely think that this one, price-wise, budget-wise, is really great money for the value. Um, those ones are also just really gorgeous, and it just depends on what you're really looking for. Like these, they look 
beautiful and expensive. This one looks cute. It's very cute, so. happy, and vibrant. All right, guys, so that's it for this video. Let me know in the comments below what you look for when you're shopping for a candle. Are you looking for soy blend? Are you looking for a three-wick candle, a two-wick candle, votive candles, tea light candles? What's your favorite type of candle, guys? And what type of scent do you like? Make sure you leave a comment in the comment section. If you are new to this channel, make sure you do hit that subscribe button as well as that little bell icon beside it so you never miss a video notification. I do have new videos out every single week about um, new product launches, business tips, beauty tips, as well as awesome hauls. And if this looks like fun to you guys and you're interested in building an online Avon business, make sure you do go to the description box below and click that join Avon button so you can get your Avon business up and running right away. All right, guys, I love you guys. Until next time. Bye-bye. And so guys, if you enjoyed this video, make sure you give this video a big fat thumbs up. Yeah. And don't forget to subscribe. Bye guys. See you. Bye. -bye. Bye. Thank you. So, oh, why is that, Daddy? Oh.